The next step in our journey of Google Slides is text. Now, the first thing you need to know about text in Google Slides is if you want to use text, you need a text box. Text box looks like a box with the letter T for text in it. And I click that, and now I can make a text box on my screen, whatever size I want. I can also change the size of a text box. So down here, for example, I have two different text boxes with the exact same text in it. If I change a text box, it will change the shape of that text. If I double click inside a shape, also I can put text inside a shape. Where it gets to be fun though is when we start changing text. So if I highlight some text or if I just put my cursor in here, I can change either the font and there are a list of fonts at the top you can pull down. This is just a, a small number of what's available. I can also change the size. This is called the font size. I can make something bold, italic, underlined, or with this gray A here, I can change the color of the text. Also, I've got a highlight color. If I, highlight, if I click highlight, I can choose a color that I want to highlight my text. So there are lots of fonts available. I, I think there's more than a thousand available inside of Google Slides. Uh, you can see them all at fonts.google.com or you can click the fonts up here and go to more fonts. You can search for different types of fonts. So uh, if you're looking for a Japanese font, for example, but, or it's just a very popular font, um, you've got them all available to you. Go, go nuts. But, and this is critical, you have to make sure that the font you choose really matches the content you're creating. So if you're doing a school report, you don't want to pick a really outlandish font. On the other hand, you probably don't want to use the same you know, boring font you would use for a school report if you're making a poster to advertise an event. Fonts matter. Fonts can make the difference between a line being you know, a critical part of a romance movie or a horror show. So that's all I've got on fonts. We'll be back with you soon.